Welcome to my tutorial on how to create the Hirons Boot CD 12.0 which is an all-in-one bootable CD which includes all the utilities that are listed on this web page. Most of which are for Windows only, there's some for Linux as well none are for Mac unfortunately and all the links I use in this video can be found in the description box below So, what will you need? The Hirons Boot CD ISO file an ISO CD burner, burn CD CC is the one used in this video, and a blank CD of 370 MB or more, so the standard size probably be 700 MB. Let's begin by downloading the Hirons Boot CD 12.0 ISO file. So, if you click this link here, and you save the file, it's a very large file, so I'm going to skip it along in this video. Once the file is finished downloading, head over to wherever your default download location is and open it up. Then we're going to extract all files. Let's just wait for that to extract. So once it's finished extracting, open that one up and now we're going to have a look at the contents of this folder up here is an execu executable file the burn cdcc that's the software we're going to be using to burn the Hirons Boot CD 12.0 ISO file to the CD so if you open up that program now press the browse button and locate the Hirons Boot CD 12.0 ISO file. Choose the CD drive that you're going to put the CD in. I'm going to use E. Tick the box Read Verify and the box Finalize. And then drag this slider down to CD 32 times and DVD 4 times. Once you've done that, press Start. When this dialog appears, your CD drive should automatically open. So place your blank CD in and press OK. Your CD drive should automatically go in. And now it's just reading the disk. And this process usually takes about 10 minutes depending on your drive speed, so I'll just skip it along. The file that we're writing onto this disk is about 370 megabytes in size. So the CD you want to use, you get many CDs of 700 MB, so that's probably a good idea. For this particular video, the DVD Plus R was used, but a rewritable CD would also be fine. Once the process is complete, it says complete right here and your CD drive will auto automatically open and you can take the CD out so now you can just close the program and you're done you've created the Hirons Boot CD 12.0 and now I'm going to show you how the CD works I apologize for the poor picture quality so the CD's in the laptop I've pressed F12 to bring up the boot dialog here and I've now chosen CD DVD might be F8 to bring out the boot dialog on your computer and the disk will load and this is the Hirons boot CD window it has many utilities as you can see I won't go through all of them but a few of my favourites the mini Windows XP opens a module which looks very similar to Windows XP and has many modules inside of that in the start menu sort of visual and there's the um, offline password changer for Windows 2000 XP Vista and 7 so that's very useful to change the password, remove a password from a user account in Windows there's also the Comboot which calls himself the password hacking tool and there are many others on here
you can see that this continues and another page as well and that concludes my video on how to create the Hewans Boot CD 12.0 all the links I used can be found in the description along with more information feel free to rate and comment and subscribe if you found my video useful thanks for watching